YouTubers! Black Country Trucker here. Welcome to my channel. This is just my little guide to driving hours and working hours. This is what I do. Right? I'm not telling you the rules because I don't fully know all the rules because I don't need to. Right? I know the rules that I understand and I use every day and those are the ones I'm going to tell you. Right. Driving hours first of all. Four and a half hours, you've got to have a 45 minute break. Or you can have a 15 minute break in those four and a half hours and then a 30 minute break. And you can do that twice a day. That'll give you your nine hours work, uh, your nine hours driving. Now, twice a week, you can drive for 10 hours. So again, after your second four and a half, after your second four and a half, you can then have a break and you can have your 10th hour drive, and that's twice a week. Now what I do, I tend to have a 15 minute break, and then when it's coming up to four and a half, I'll have a 30 minute break. And that also gets rid of my working time directive, so I can have my break for that as well. So, you can't drive any any longer than 56 hours in any given week. Right. Working time directive wise, six hours working time, you have to have at least 15 minutes break. Now, usually my first four and a half aren't even over but before the first six hours. So my 15 minute break will usually cover that. And then by the time I finish my first four and a half, that's the nine hours working time. So I've had my 30 minute break to cover that one because you have to have 50, you have to have at least 15 minutes in your first six and then after three hours, which is your nine hours, you then have to have a 30 minute, okay? Now, twice a week you can work for 15 hours lucky people in we? we get to work for 15 hours twice a week get in but if you work for 15 hours you automatically reduce your rest time down to nine hours right now you can only reduce your rest time down to nine hours three times a week so if you've worked two 15 hour shifts in one week one working week I should say because some people work Saturday to Saturday I work Monday to Friday um, if you've reduced twice down to nine hours on 15 hour shifts then you've only got one left and it can't be off an automatically reduction from a 15 hour shift because you can only do that twice a week okay your normal rest period is 11 hours now what you can also do you can have a three hour rest in the daytime and then a reduced nine hour rest at night because that's your full 11 hours it just doesn't make sense does it I was just thinking about that then that's 9, 10, 11, 12 hours so I'm scamming an error off you basically tossers as I said this is only what I I do um, so if I am wrong and Vausa, you are watching this um, my vehicle registration is um, I can't remember but I drive a really 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 old banger daff so if you see me on the road that, that's me you can pull me over um, so yeah four and a half hours driving 15 minute break in between the four and a half and then a 30 minute to make a 45 minute break for the four and a half 10 hours twice a week driving working time six hours have a 15 minute break after nine hours working you have a 30 minute break and then if you're going to do another three hours work you have to have another 30 minute break my driving driving breaks normally cover my working time breaks so that's nothing for me to worry about you can't work for any longer than 60 hours a week and over a four month period 
your working time has got to average out to 48 hours. So I believe. Um, I don't, I usually work, my average is probably about 48 hours to be perfectly honest. And driving time, it's not very often I drive over 40 hours in a week because I'm always doing other stuff other than driving. Like I could spend a couple of hours on a site just tipping or loading. So, yeah, I'm pretty lucky that way. Uh, but that's that's my little guide to it and how I actually do my hours. Now I'm pretty lucky because in my truck, which is uh, a banged old daff, honestly, in my truck, um, we'll just cover that up a bit. I have a breakdown of my driving hours for that day and for the week, so it will say period of driving time in the fir like first or second four and a half, how many hours I've driven, minutes, and then underneath that will give my subtotal for my day, and then underneath that will give my subtotal for the week. So that's one thing I absolutely love about this banged old DAF, it's really bad DAF that I drove. Um, <clears throat> so that is my guide basically. If I've missed anything, or if you think I'm doing something totally wrong, or if you think that video was absolute shite, or if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, or if you want to subscribe, please subscribe, and if you really don't give a shit about anything, and you're not really bothered, then welcome to the club. And that's the Black Country Trucker out.